Hello everyone. So in this video, we are going to discuss about how to use the Google Map. Okay. So a um, lot of people are asking about uh, make a video in the Google Map. So I'm making this video. Uh, if you have any query or any doubt, you can make it in the comment box. So first, I'm going to my Visual Studio and I'm going to create a new component actually. Control Shift to P. Okay, create a lightning web component and uh, Google map. I'm name I'm creating the new LWC. Okay, so our new component has been created here. Now I'm just I'm going to replace the this component. I will explain you what are what is these things. Okay, so this is the Google Map content basically. Google Map, this is the uh, standard LWC co uh, component actually. So if you go to the, um, go to, yeah, here you can see this is the component library. You can see Lightning Web Component Library. In this library, you can see it all the uh, standard LWC is available like a button, a button icon, button group, cards um like a confirmation button data table flows and the input field input input address location everything is available in this section itself we have map okay so if you click on this you can see it, uh these are the details available so they have given the what is the what are the attributes available and uh, so how to how to use like a hurry kind of things you need to use so uh, ma uh, map maker Inside that location, state, city, country, we need to give. Okay. A uh, title is for the just naming only. Description, what is the use of this location? Some some kind of things we need to give. Similarly, you can see it all the things uh, and all the things you can check it. And one more thing, instead of if you you do you don't know the location means we can use the long latitude and longitude we can use. Okay. So if you don't know how what is the latitude and longitude, let me know. I will explain those things. Okay. So now I hope you understand like how to uh, get the standard LWC component here. Uh, just I will show you the UI how it will be look like. So I'm going to show you like uh, the existing components are already available in the LWC. Just I'm going to show you how we can able to build it. That's it. Okay. Uh, yeah. Now we have created that uh, um, lightning map. In that we have three attributes I have used: map, marker, so, and zoom level and distribute. Okay, so now we we have created this, but till now we not set the value for the those uh, variables. Okay, for that we need this. Now we can see it. Uh, there are three is created now. Map maker. So map maker it means like array kind of things. Multiple map are. Uh, location also we can able to add it here okay i will tell you how to add the multiples so now you can see only one specifically now so for that inside that we need to add one location that location we need to use street city state and country also we can use uh some uh um like a um other things also we can use like a, a, a street city state country i think the four things we can able to use it you can see it here yeah, here you can see it. City, country, postal code, state, and state. A, 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 anything we can able to use. The, these five. Okay. So now, now for testing purpose, I'm using only three. Uh, street, city, state only I'm using. Okay. The title is just for the naming. For, just if you go to that map, the title will be displayed. That's it. Nothing else. If there is no functionality about this one. And description. So what is the location of this one? Just the meaning. Okay. This is about the map matter. So here the map marker is already available here. Okay. And now zoom level. How much zoom level? So we can able to give up to 100% we can able to give. Okay. Zero, uh, 1 to 100% we can able to give. Okay. And uh, list view. So list view visible. That's it. Okay. You can make it this one. So now I'm going to save this component and I'm going to deploy to my R. Deploy to source R. Okay, so common has been deployed successfully. Now this is my dev work. So I'm going to refresh it first.
Okay, I'm going to add my new LWC comment here. Go to edit page. Oh, sorry. Actually, I forget to add the um, connected data. Wait on a second. Can copy paste this. We should use this one true, and we are going to use in the home page. So we should use the lightning iPhone iPhone home page. We should use. Okay. Now I will redeploy again. Uh, deploy again this one. Deploy source to R. Okay, so it's deployed again. Now we can we need to refresh it again. I have some uh, existing comment. I will remove it. Okay, now I will check Salesforce Google Map. Okay, our comment came here. I'll uh, just I'm try drag and okay. save. Changes are saved. It's not key. Go to edit page again. Actually, yeah, add it in the home page. Mm -hmm. Google map added, but here I can see it. The Google map added successfully. Let's remove all the existing things. Save to the activation, maybe. Save, save it again and go back. Yeah, now you can see it. Uh, our map is came here, and you can see the exact location it's pointing here. What are the location we have given? That location is pointing here. So similarly, uh, you can use the multiple location also. Like uh, here, you can see it marker one, uh, marker only one one is showing. So if you use a multiple location, then all the location will be show as the red color here, different different colors. Okay. Um. So it, this is if you think it's like a zoom level, a zoom level is the size of this one high means we can set the height of the component. For example. Um, here we can use one div. So in the div, we can set the height. So we have div inside the div. We are going to use this wide array. Okay, so this tag we missed. Okay, now we can use style and we can set the height. Um, height is like a 50%, 50px, and uh, width. With the Phoenix. Save it now. And then you can redeploy this one. Let's see difference. Now go to the R. 
refresh it first. And one more thing I forgot to say, if you want, you can do the zoom also you can do and you can do the out also like a zoom out also you can see it okay so the zoom level is we are defining here in the back end you can see zoom level 15 if you give like a 80 or 90 then it will be zoom those kind of level okay. now we have added the height let's see it Oh, for that, I can see it's a very, very small. Maybe I will increase size like uh, 250, I will give. Okay, try so strong. So, refresh it, let's see it. Yeah, actually, it's little bit only is coming, basically. So, maybe I will give something more. If I enter, I will give. Please, I it again. Now you can see it's it's better now. Save go back. Yeah, now you can see it. Uh, width and height has been 500 we have given. So this much level is coming. If you don't want 500 also, we can able to reduce. And here you can see it like a location. So if you click on this, what is the exact location it will be binding? So you can do the zoom and you can zoom out and anything you can do that okay so this is kind of the map thing and one more thing like if you want to go the multiple means like a multiple location you can do that similarly but this is one location and this is for another location so if you go for the multiple location we should use the uh yeah, so we can use the multiple location, but some of things like a even kind of things we need to use. Okay, for that you can copy the whole thing and you can try by for yourself. Okay, and uh, yeah, I hope you have um understand in, about the Google Map. And if you have any queries on any command, uh, just uh, put it in my command box and I will reply. Okay, thanks you. Thanks, thanks all.